Is less than perfect credit putting the brakes on your mobility? Without transportation, you can't really do anything in Atlanta. The solution could be a little black box away. That little black box is a device called On Time, and it's helping people stay behind the wheel by not letting them get behind in their payments. Because if they don't pay, they don't drive. Fred Powers is live in Midtown with a story you'll see only on CBS 46. Stephanie, it's pretty simple. The box is hooked up to your car here underneath your steering wheel. It's nobody's choice if you don't want the device, but if you don't make a payment, you don't have a choice. Your car isn't going anywhere. With my busy schedule, you know, not you know, being able to have to remember everything, it just lets me know. So I know three days before that it's time to make a payment. Cindy Milk here is a busy single mother who ran into some roadblocks while looking for a reliable car she could afford. But thanks to a little device called On Time, <laughs> back behind the wheel. This product was designed to rebuild people's credit and to allow people who have had credit problems to buy a vehicle that normally could not buy a vehicle because of their previous credit transactions. Cindy is one of about a thousand drivers in Atlanta with this device in their car. The on-time device uses blinking lights and sounds to remind you when your car payment is due. When you make your payment, you receive a code to to enter into the device. It's very easy. I come in here um, every 30 days, uh, make my payment, I get a new code, put the code in, good to go for another 30 days. But if a code isn't entered by the day the payment is due, the device signals a chip in the car starter, stopping the car from turning over. Jeff Fowler, the owner of Metro Motors, uses the device on all the cars he sells. It has enabled us to go back into the car selling business and not in the collection business. As for his customers... It's been good. It's been really good. And on time all the time. <laughs> and back live, some people say the box gives up too much control. But Metro Motors says they're possessing fewer cars, 5% down from 30. Reporting live in Midtown, Fred Power, CBS 46, Atlanta's News Channel.